Over the past couple of weeks, many have shared their concerns over the launch and wastewater treatment plant dumping into the creeks. Now people can know their concerns were warranted after the city was issued a notice of violation from the Oklahoma Department of Environmental Quality. 7 News investigative reporter Seth Marsicato has more. Many people in Lawton and surrounding areas have been voicing their concerns about the quality of water in East Cache and Nine Mile Creek. And on April 18th, the Oklahoma Department of Environmental Quality issued a notice of violation for the Lawton Wastewater Treatment Plant. I'm concerned with how long this has been happening, and we're just becoming aware of this because this NOV was issued. According to the notice, from late February to early April, six complaints were filed from those concerned about environmental damages to the creeks. And while the city stated the facility's discharge was indeed not raw sewage, according to the DEQ, it wasn't as safe as the city let on. An April 9th press release stated, quote, the discharge into Nine Mile Creek is having no negative impact. DEQ put on a several month long investigation in response to the complaints, which led them to find the city has been in violation since December of 2023. In this case, it was determined that East Cache Creek and Nine Mile Creek were both negatively impacted by the quality of the effluent from Lawton's wastewater treatment plant. Both the DEQ and city officials have said the facility has a consent order and in our original interview with city manager John Ratliff, because of this consent order, they do not have to maintain compliance, which is also reflected by the press release sent on April 9th. However, Hatfield says there are still expectations. So while they may not be meeting the regular standards, they are to operate at the absolute highest possible efficiency that they can. The city is required to submit discharge monitoring reports according to the notice and through 19 reported monitoring periods, only one didn't exceed permit limits. The reason areas fell short according to the city press release sent April 19th is because of unexpected equipment failure. What is the city of Lawton going to do to correct these issues? Um, has anything already happened? Is anything gonna happen? When? It is unknown what action the city plans on taking as no one was available to comment at this time. So we believe from our talks with personnel there at the wastewater treatment facility that the issues were caused by the failure of assist essential treatment equipment. And it is our understanding that the city is waiting for the delivery of the replacement equipment. The city has 30 days to respond to the notice. When received, officials with DEQ will evaluate their response and determine proper enforcement. Reporting for 7 News, I'm Seth Marsicano.